It's on the couch. Hey, what in the world am I looking at? We have a half court shootout. Oh. Oh, God. Hello, everyone. It is Matthew. Welcome back to a brand new video. And today, I'm just going to be doing a vlog along with Super Bowl predictions. Uh, I have a lot of stuff planned throughout today, so I'm just going to be videoing uh, throughout my day, vlogging and stuff, and also throughout the video, I'm going to be doing my Super Bowl predictions and other people's Super Bowl predictions, including Daisy's. So uh, a lot of stuff planned for this video, going to be vlogging, and also Dog predicts the Super Bowl, and I guess my Super Bowl predictions as well. Uh, before we get started, though, make sure you guys leave a like on the video, and also, if you're new to the channel, make sure you guys hit the subscribe button, and now, let's go ahead and start today's video. Daisy the dog! So Super Bowl 58 is officially set up. We know the matchup. It is the Kansas City Chiefs versus the San Francisco 49ers. A rematch of Super Bowl 54. I think it's going to be an unbelievable game. But before I talk about the game and give my predictions, it's time for everybody's favorite yearly tradition. It's time for Daisy to choose the winner of the Super Bowl. Daisy, it is your time to shine. It's your time to choose who you think is going to win Super Bowl 58. We have everything set up. Uh, I just wrote on the piece of papers with the names of the teams. We have the Chiefs right there, the 49ers right there, and we have potato chips in front of each paper, which everyone Daisy goes to and eats, is the one she thinks is gonna win the Super Bowl. Are you ready? And you want that toy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. But now you gotta go over there. Okay, it's on the couch. Daisy's walking over there. And she eats the Kansas City Chiefs. Well, she hasn't yet, but now she has. Daisy has chosen the Kansas City Chiefs to win Super Bowl 58 over the San Francisco 49ers. Daisy picks the Chiefs uh, for the second straight year. So Daisy has officially chosen the Kansas City Chiefs to beat the San Francisco 49ers in Super Bowl 58. She chose the Chiefs last year and she got it right. So why change it now? Goes with them again this year. And she has the Chiefs going back to back and beating the 49ers. She got it right last year with the Chiefs and why change it now? Good job, Daisy. Now that Daisy's done her predictions, it's time for me to do mine. First off, though, make sure you guys go leave your predictions for the game. Who's going to win? What's going to be the final score down below in the comments? Before I get into my predictions, I'm going to talk about the game real fast because this is a really interesting one. I'm super excited for this game. Obviously, lots of people aren't the happiest that these are the two teams meeting in the Super Bowl. And I get that because they're the two most winningest teams in the NFL over the last five or six years. But I'm excited for this match. Matchup. I'm not a person that dislikes a team just because they win a lot. And I, if it's not going to be my team in the Super Bowl, which it hasn't been in the in my lifetime, I want it to be the two best teams meeting up in the Super Bowl that make the best possible matchup. And even though these may not be the most liked teams because they always win. I just mainly want the best possible matchup in between the two best teams in the NFL, and I think we got that this year. And I have nothing against these teams. I'm really excited for this game. I think it's going to be an unbelievable game. Obviously, the Chiefs, they have been in four of the last five Super Bowls. They're looking for their third Super Bowl win to cement their dynasty. The 49ers, every year, they are one of the best teams in the NFL, but they've never got that Super Bowl win. They lost in Super Bowl 54 to the Chiefs. This is a Super Bowl rematch, and every year, the Niners are so close, but is this the year they finally get that Super Bowl win? This is no doubt the best team 49ers have had in these last few years, and I think it's going to be a great game. We've had two straight really good Super Bowls. I think we're in store for a third. It's now time for my predictions. We're going straight into it. I think the winner of Super Bowl 58 will be the Chiefs. I'm going with the Chiefs to win the Super Bowl over the 49ers. I think the 49ers are the better team uh, on paper. Uh, this is the best team, like I said, the 49ers have had, and they had a way better regular season. The Chiefs kind of struggled in the regular season, but in the end, I'm not betting against the Chiefs. I'm not betting against Patrick Mahomes. I think they win this, cement their dynasty, win a third Super Bowl in the last five years, beat the 49ers again. I think it's going to be kind of a low-scoring game. Uh, I will say 24-21 to 21 Chiefs. Now, 
I could really see this being a toss-up game. I really think it's 50-50. If I were to do percentages, I would say 51% of me says the Chiefs are going to win. 49 says the 49ers are going to win. I think no matter what, this is going to be a close game regardless of who wins. I think it's a really good matchup, and in the end, I'm going to go with the Chiefs. Now, interesting enough, when I filmed my NFL predictions video a few weeks ago, I actually filmed it the first time with me predicting the Chiefs and 49ers meeting in the Super Bowl. Now, I did have the 49ers winning, but afterwards, for some reason, I went and refilmed it and had the Chiefs losing to the Bills and then the Bills making it to the Super Bowl. And for some reason, I was in my gut thinking, why would I bet against the Chiefs and Patrick Mahomes? And I should enough, here they are in the Super Bowl, the Chiefs and the 49ers, Super Bowl 58. It's going to be a great game, I think. I think it's a toss-up, but I'm going with the Chiefs. So now that that's out of the way, uh, I'm going to be vlogging throughout the rest of today. I have a lot of stuff in store, and if I see anybody uh, throughout the videos, I'll be asking them their Super Bowl predictions as well. But uh, I'm, right now, I'm actually about to go to the store, going to be going to Target, got to get a few things, including the gift card for the winner of the last giveaway. And speaking of giveaway, I actually just started a brand new one just a few days ago. So if you haven't entered that giveaway, go and do that. And if you have, good luck. But but now we're going to Target. Daisy, I'll see you later. Everyone, I have officially made it here to Bullseye's Barbecue Sauce, also known as Target. Now there's only two things that I came in here for, for sure, and that was one, the gift card, and two, I need water bottles because I drink like seven to eight water bottles a day and I have zero at home, so I gotta get those, and I'm sure I'll probably get a few more things. Uh, I know I need to look for the last two flavors of Prime that I need, uh, so yeah. Everyone's favorite sections, the sporting goods, mainly because hopefully there's like loose footballs. There's not! And then you throw them to yourself. What in the world? I guess I'll use a soccer ball. I do need to get a mini basketball hoop because me and Daisy used to play all the time. She would be the defender and I would be the um, offensive player. And she'd try to stop me from scoring every time. And she could steal the ball a lot. She's like defensive player of the year, prime Kawhi Leonard. I forgot to mention the reason I need one though. Um, I may or may not have dunked on it too hard and tore the rim off completely, but that's against the point. Oh, and we have Prime, only problem, they have every single flavor we have. Now, we did find the Cherry Freeze flavor, because uh, the last video where I was trying to look for all the flavors of Prime, we didn't have the Cherry Freeze, but we found it a few days ago, and they have a ton of it here. The only two they don't have uh, are the two we need, which is grape and orange, and I may have to order them online, because they are literally nowhere to be found. They have everything else. Here's the water bottles, but I just realized a major problem. I never grabbed a cart, meaning I may have to carry these throughout the whole store. I'm just gonna go get a cart. I got a cart. There was no way I was carrying that around the whole time. Also, I got some Feastables. These are the only two flavors they had. Uh, I'm also gonna be doing like a Feastables rankings short video. Uh, one of these crunch ones are for me because the crunch is one of the best flavors, but those are the only two they have. So the other two are for the actual ranking video if I could ever find the other ones. You know, I gotta check and see if some way Red Velvet Pop-Tarts are back, but I don't see any. They're probably never coming back. Ooh, cinnamon roll. That's new, I think. Banana bread, Apple Jacks. Interesting. Some new flavors. Um, honestly, though, I really don't care for Pop-Tarts other than the red velvet ones. Those are the best things ever made. The good old days are back. You know what time it is. <gasps> oh, gosh. Oh, my gosh. Cops are coming. We better run. What in the world am I looking at? It's talking to me. By the way, I came into a different store that was across the street from Target, also looking for Prime. They had all the flavors other than the two I needed, and I found a robot while I was here. I didn't even bring in my camera, so I'm vlogging on the iPhone. Daisy the dog! Run. Daisy, I've made it home, even though I was only gone for like 30 minutes, not like uh, eternity. Here. Boom! <laughs> come on, it's time to come inside. What in the world is that? 
I'm actually about to be leaving the house uh, again because I'm going to film episode number two of the high school basketball series. The high school basketball season is back underway. I filmed episode number one over a month ago in December, and I haven't gone to any games since, but I'm going to a huge game that's around 45 minutes away. Uh, we're back with the high school basketball series. I have four unbelievable games that I'm going to over the next four weeks, multiple four or five star players, some of the top teams in the state and some of the top teams in the nation. So many good games. The high school basketball series. I know you guys love it. It is back. Episode number two. I'm going to film right now. It's like 45 minutes away. That video will probably be out before this one. So if you haven't seen that, go watch it. But I have so many cool or so many good episodes of the high school basketball series coming up. Like I said, four games in the next month, but it's time to hit the road. Like I said, I got a 45 minute drive. I left my keys in there. Great. 45 minutes later, I have made it here to the school. We have a half court shootout. Oh. Oh, oh, I thought that was in. Oh. 15 seconds, it's almost already over. We got a half court, half time shootout. Oh. At the buzzer, we'll count it. Ah, oh, no one made it. Daisy, I'm back home. Are you excited? She has to go get one of her toys whenever I get home. So that is gonna be all for today's video. Thank you all for watching. This was a really cool video. Obviously did my Super Bowl predictions. I went with the Chiefs. Daisy also went with the Chiefs. Now Daisy's one and one in Super Bowl predictions. She uh, chose the Bengals uh, two years ago and was incorrect, but last year chose the Chiefs and she was correct. So this is the tiebreaker. She's one for one, uh, but uh, hopefully you all enjoyed the video. Make sure you guys leave a like on the video. Comment down below who you think's gonna win the Super Bowl and make sure you guys hit the subscribe button if you're new to the channel. I have so many cool videos coming out soon. You're not going to want to miss, but that's going to be all for this one. So till next video, see ya!